Number 72. Write the rate law for each of the following elementary reactions. And then we have O3 plus Cl yields O2 plus ClO. Okay, so from this balanced equation, always make sure that it's balanced, but it looks pretty balanced to me. But from a balanced equation, we just have to write a rate law. And they give us a huge heads up. They do say that this equation is an elementary reaction. And if it's an elementary reaction, that means that it's a single step. It's a one step process. No extra steps going on here. What you see is what you get. And writing rate laws for elementary single step reactions are very simple because they abide by the same rate law with just with a little uh, difference here. The rate law for elementary reactions are this or is this. Maybe what I'll say is that we can only use this if we know that the equation that uh, they gave us is an elementary reaction or an elementary step. Now, the only difference here is that it's still rate equals K times the concentration of reactants. Remember, nobody cares about the products um, when you're dealing with rate laws. But the only difference is that these are raised to the coefficients. We are now allowed to just look at the coefficients aka the big numbers, and um, put them as the orders. We are only allowed to do that because this is what you get. What you see is what you get. You only have one equation. For overall reactions, you might have two, three, four equations smushed together to produce out one overall reaction, and that's where the coefficients don't match. But here is fair game. So let's go for it. Rate equals K, the rate constant, times by the concentration of the reactants. In this case, we have O3. So let's write down O3. And the other reactant we have is Cl. So I'm going to write that down. Okay, reactants are done. Now, all we have to do is just raise them to the coefficients. O3, there was one O3. So I could put a one here, but you don't have to if you don't want to. And then I have only one chlorine. So I could put a one here and I, you know, if I don't want to, I don't have to, um, because anything raised to the first is itself. And that's it. This is the end. How fast was that, right? Crazy. We love elementary reactions <laughs> because they're just, you know, pretty easy to do. But this is the final rate law for this elementary step or this elementary reaction. And that's it. I hope this helped. Let me know in the comments. Thank you so much for viewing the video. Subscribe to the channel and I look forward to helping you with more questions. Always keep learning and I'll talk to you soon, okay? All right. Bye-bye. That was a little weird. Bye-bye. <laughs>